Hey guys, what is going on? It is Perped Games, and today I'm going to be telling you why Rockstar have stopped patching their money glitches in their game Grand Theft Auto 5 for all consoles, really. And there's a pretty good reason. I mean, the BAP system is still going on because they, why not? I mean, they have no reason to turn it off. So be careful when doing glitches, but they have stopped patching them because GTA 6 is coming out. Now, all of you are like, so what if GTA 6 is coming out? What difference does that make to Rockstar releasing patches for all their games? They'll release updates for GTA 5, including things, but the point is, they've realised that every time they patch a glitch, we will find another, and they will it will keep going on until they give up, and I think it's got to that stage for three years, We've been battling it out with Rockstar for two years ju just to have a glitch that stays. And like with the daily objective, that glitch has been out for months. Obviously, Rockstar have been doing little things when they've had spare time, but nothing so big, just stopping the glitch altogether. And now that we've got that time trial glitch that's really useful and stops people. But, you know, it's just great. I mean, it's really nice to not get patched, but... Until someone finds a duplication glitch or summer, it's not really worth it anyway. But, like, when GTA 5 was announced, they've stopped patching GTA 4 because they need, their main priority is now this new game. And because, like, Just Cause 2, for example, I know they didn't have many glitches, they had hundreds of glitches, and then, obviously, because Just Cause 3 is coming out, they would stop patching them and... Obviously, that's going to make a big difference. So, anyway, guys, like and subscribe. I will see you in the next video. Also, tell me if you like the face cam. I think it's pretty cool. See ya.